and it's all a misunderstanding. It's just, it's, it's all a, a conscious or unconscious misunderstanding. Well, uh, talking about misunderstandings in the sun, um, oh, can you break down uh, some of the, um, just the relationship between people wearing sunglasses during the day and mm -hmm. uh, to block that and then, you know, not wearing anything at night? Uh, mm -hmm. how that can kind of play out because lots of people wearing sunglasses. Right, right. And the reason people are wearing sunglasses, there was a study in the 1950s, I believe, and they, uh, they did a, a uh, ran an experiment with mice who are nocturnal animals, by the way, and don't have skin, they have fur. Um, so they, they sleep during the day and they're awake at night. So they weren't designed to see sunlight. But, but they, do, they did a, this experiment with um, UV light bulbs that didn't have full spectrum light, right? Just, U, just UV light. And these mice, you know, got sick. Um, they, they, they got skin cancer. And so from that unconscious study, uh, which, you know, it, it was unconscious because it just lacked controls and there were no controls. Uh, they, they, uh. Used, they used the wrong animal at the wrong time in the wrong conditions. And from that developed this dogma that the sun is bad for you. So you should block it from entering your skin and you should prevent it from entering your eyes. Right? Uh. So that's why, that's why people, that's why people do that. That's the, it's like the only reason that I'm aware of as, as to why people do that. And so what they're doing in doing that is they are, they're preventing sleep. Like they're fighting sleep without knowing it. And the way melatonin is made is it, it goes, it hits the eye and then it creates melatonin when it interacts with, with tryptophan. So uh, that makes the thing that causes us to sleep. Right? So by wearing sunglasses, you're just, you're not allowing your body to, to print its own money. And, and then you end up having to rely on, on you know, borrowing. Oh, so that dude, that, that makes me think of like the fat, like uh, the, the anti-fat campaign. It's, it's just like, ooh, fat makes you fat. fat. And it's like, fuck, yeah. no, it doesn't. It's the exact same thing. It's yeah. the exact same campaign. It's the exact same campaign. And just like the other thing I talked about with the divide that we were talking about, it's like, hmm, this is happening again. We're divided again. What is what is behind all of this? Yeah. And you know, for me, there's the one thing I know is that there there is not if you want to be healthy, if you if you want to be disease free, if you want to be alive. If, if you want to die of old age and have had sex the night before you pass and move on, then don't listen, don't listen to the common advice coming from like government websites. That's <laughs> so, so frustrating. It's that... frustrating. Right? Yeah. And this is what we're waking up yeah. from. Right. Yeah. So That's why I say it's just it's a really amazing time, despite the divide, because because consciousness is winning, and we're and and we're we're going to come back to the same place, upgraded. Yeah. But uh, but this is what we also need to do with sleep. Like it's the the formula is the same, and so the going back to the basics, right? Like somebody listening who wants to sleep better is like, oh, you can just. Get, like <laughs> how 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 do i do it um yeah. well the, the 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 simplest way is if you reverse that if you don't wear sunglasses during the day and if you're wondering why i'm outside right now it's because i'm making melatonin you know i'm 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 literally sleeping right now that's what i'm doing yeah. i'm daytime sleeping so don't wear glasses during the day that cover your eyes and we have all sorts of, of photoreceptors in our eyes, neuropsin, melanopsin, rhodopsin. There's, there's, there are all these opsins, and they all have these different functions. 
and but but they're they're there to keep you awake and to build to uh, create the ingredients and you know make make the um, the sleep recipes yeah and and so if you if you allow your natural circadian functionality to do its thing and then at night block the unnatural light yeah. whose whose frequencies mimic sunlight but in a non-healing way just in a stimulating way mm-hmm. right those same frequencies like 430 to 465 specifically start to tell your brain like hey it's daytime and you should be awake right now here's a little bit of cortisol here's a little bit of adrenaline right um so it the impact is profound if you just make that switch of letting your eyes see the sunlight and then not letting your eyes see the the blue light the the leds and the fluorescence 